like a hell cut. All right, welcome back, everybody. So we're back today with another episode. So we went ahead and emptied our inventory. We need to hurry up because we got to go get food. So actually, let's go ahead and eat some kayup. Eat some of this so we can hold ourselves over until we go get some protein. We might eat one of those too, just because. All right, now I want to show you real quick. Uh, before we started recording, we went ahead, this was full power and mass, so we went ahead and I'm thinking we need this next. This is a power storage, so we made that and then I think we're going to make a mass storage next, I think, because once this fills up, you don't store anymore, so these should allow us to store more. I think I also want to work on getting... Uh, either solar panels or wind turbines. I'm not sure which. Uh, they both require a lot of stuff that we don't have. Oh, wait. Let me check real quick. So somebody posted in the comments for me to check my light. I, I keep forgetting. So let's see. Thank you, by the way. 40%. It's still early, so I'm going to try and come back in the middle of the day and check this again when the sun's directly over top of it, and we'll see if it's any different. But thank you for mentioning that. I keep forgetting to check that, because the light, however much percentage light you're getting, is going to determine how quickly your plants grow. So, something to keep an eye on, that's for sure. I already knew building down there, we were going to have poor light towards the end of the day because we're behind that until we get up higher. But we'll see if it changes at all. 40% uh, is not very good. So, I'm not sure. I did see a video where somebody was playing and it seemed like to them their grow plots were getting less sunlight when they were uh, facing like horizontally as opposed to vertically so maybe we'll try that try turning it and see if that makes a difference as well I'm not sure we'll see we'll see but thank you again for mentioning that in the comments I just kept forgetting that And I also, I'm glad you're enjoying this series so far. I'm going to try and avoid everything. Uh, but it's not going to be easy because we can't go that way really. I would like to, one of these days, not, not today, because today, like I said, I want to go back at midday, check that planner box, and then I also want to go back and check on the mass, or the, oh shoot, the power storage, so that we can um, check on that, so I'm not sure exactly how that works but I'm assuming it's just like it says power storage because when the BCU gets to 500 power that's it it doesn't generate anymore because you're capped out now I'm thinking with the power storage I don't know if they've changed it to where so many I saw where your BCU Man, I really need some protein. We need to prioritize. Stop gathering stuff. And we need to prioritize protein. Because our stamina is terrible. Absolutely atrocious. So that's what we're going to do right now. Oh, 
I'm sure you guys probably already know this, my hotbar. I went ahead and crafted the shotgun because, like I said, those hunters moved in and I'm a little sketched out because of that. I don't want to end up getting caught with my britches down with those guys. So I went ahead and made that so that way we have something better than the pistol. Because the pistol does not... I don't know. I just don't feel like it is the best for defense. I mean, oh my goodness, we're dying already. So we're malnourished. I guess we probably should have ate more. Alright, we need to just cool it. There's a rabbit. Or is that a chicken? That's a chest. That tis neither. Normally I'd be happy to see chests. Right now I just really need some protein. We might actually die. I'm going to make this loop around. So there's usually a rabbit or a chicken or something over here. And if I don't find anything, I'll head back to base and eat some more. I wish you could eat these medicinal plants. Can you? No. I wish. That'd be nice because I got a load of those. You know what I think? This has got me thinking now actually. I think we might go ahead and make the the rabbit trap today. Because that would be extremely beneficial. Ah. Yeah, let's head back to base. Let's go ahead. Head on over there. We'll eat some stuff. And then there's a chicken, but we're not going to be able to catch it. We don't have any stamina. So we're going to have to waste an arrow. Gotcha, boy. Yeah, we have no stamina. That'll be good. We can use that. Alright, so we have our chicken. Now, I think we're going to have to go for a swim. Because I think there was stuff up here that I don't want to tango with. Yeah, these medicinal herbs are everywhere. I wish you could eat those. I have yet to use one. I know they're made, they're used for crafting like the antidote, but you need a lot of stuff to craft that antidote and I just haven't had the resources to do it yet. I haven't really needed it either. I should probably make one just to have handy for when I do need it because I know when I do need it I'm not gonna have it so I should definitely do that alright let's go ahead head on in here we'll eat something check on our plants it's about about midday actually and check on everything honestly so let's butcher you Toss you on there. We will go ahead and drink you just because. Then we might actually eat this kelp. And then, or eat this kelp. Eat this chicken. And then maybe go diving for some kelp. That could actually be handy. We haven't done that in a while. The thing is, the lake is so deep. Out in the center, you can't go all the way down you'll take damage so just kinda have to skirt the edge so we might do that just to get some kelp and we could check the shoreline while we're doing it so that's not bad either so we'll do this eat this for sure there we go 
gives us a little bit. Let's throw this in here. That, that. This. Oh, wait. That goes in the other chest. So I did make a second chest, if you hadn't noticed yet. It's because I ran out of room. So, what am I doing? I don't need to take it. I need to put the stuff in there. Put all that in there. Um, ch -ch -ch. Yeah. So, that's good. We don't have a whole lot of time. We need to... I might just go ahead and scarf down that kelp. Let's check. 100%. Okay, so it might have been just that it was early morning. So we're at 100% right now. And our plants are doing pretty good. Almost done. Some of them. How much water was there? 12%. I don't know if it makes a difference if you put dirty water or clean water in there. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and eat some of these. Actually, do we have what it takes to make a trap? Yeah, we do. Let's do that as well. So we need sticks and cordage. Make the trap. Craft that. We could actually make the fish trap as well, probably. Uh, we need a couple more sticks. Yeah, let's do that too. Craft that. And then we'll craft the fish trap. We'll put both those out, and then we will go hunting for some kelp. Okay, now let's put you back. We don't even need the wood either. Yeah, we're topped off there, so let's go. Um, I'm thinking over here for the rabbit trap. I'm kind of liking that. I don't know if it makes a difference. If you oh I didn't bring the blueberries. I need to get the blueberries and some grubs. So we can bait these. So take two of these and two of these and call me in the morning. Nah, I'm just playing. Just playing. Can I where can I put this? I'd like to put it over here so that we can check them both. Oh. What happened? So we can check them both at the same time. I'm assuming it has to be a certain depth. Boom. That's perfect. There. Now that's baited. Come on, get out the water. Let's go over here, bait this. There we go. All right, let's let those work their magic while we go in search of kelp. We need the kelp. Not only we can eat it, but we need it to craft the antidote, I believe. Yeah, we do. So we're going to go try and grab her some of that and see how that goes try and get as much as we can we actually need sandstone too and pearls would be nice because i saw for the solar panel and the wind turbine both you need circuit boards and i think glass oh my goodness this is a long way down Go! Rise, young Skywalker. Rise! Oh, we're taking damage. Oh, we're dying, son. Oh, that hurt. Whew. So, yeah, that's about as far as we can go. Get this sandstone. We really need to just work on kelp. But, if we see it, we may as well grab it. There's some kelp there. Some kelp there. We'll get both of you. So yeah, let me know. What do you guys think? What should... Oh, come on, go up. What should we make? 
first uh, wind turbines or the solar panels I know it's gonna be beneficial to have both just because on sunny days the solar panels are gonna be killing it like today but when it's cloudy stormy stuff like that the wind turbines will kick in so we will have both but which one do you guys recommend first? Or does it matter? I don't know which one's going to be easier to make either. Uh, they both look like we don't have the stuff to make either of them just yet. Uh, we need adhesive, which uh, you get from deer antlers, from what I'm finding out. And we don't have any of that. Oh, come on. What are you doing? Goodness. We're going to take damage again. Ooh, that was close. Ooh, my goodness, that was close. Ooh, there's some kelp there. We've got to watch this bear out here. He wants a piece of us. So, yeah. There's some over there. We're doing pretty good. Not a bad day. I don't know how long, I know the animals will spoil in the traps if we leave them too long without gathering them. I don't know how long that is. Um, I'm hoping it's not within the day. I mean, we just set that stuff out there. So if we go out gathering all day, I would like to be able to go out for a full day gathering and then return back to gather our animals without having them be rotten or spoiled. Come on, oh gosh. So, can we, yeah, let's eat all this. We need it, bad. Let's gather this pearl up. I don't know if the shift button doesn't seem to be, that's what you use to run. It doesn't seem to be making us swim faster. Just kind of got to go with it. Ah, yep, yep, yep. So our biggest thing right now, one, is food, which I think those traps will help out. I think we can get that chest. And while we're up there, we'll check for any protein, because we can still use some protein. I think those traps will be good for us though, because not only are we out gathering materials and protein, now we'll have those traps out there working for us as well. So that's going to be good. A bottle of water. Look at that. Another chest right there. I'd like a rabbit. Where are you at, rabbits? It's a protein bar. We can eat that. Uh, should we? Yeah, we should. Protein's tough, man. I mean, I guess we honestly could go out... Try and bag us a deer. That would give us protein and the antlers to make the adhesive but we haven't killed one before and I'm not sure how hard it's gonna be and we don't have a whole boatload of arrows we actually only have five so we would probably have to make more yes yeah, see this is too deep for us to go in right now where are we so yeah, this is the border I was talking about in one of my previous episodes where the hunters have kind of backed us up into this corner. And so this and up the fence line there is basically as far as we can go this side of them because they kind of took everything over on the other side, which is kind of 
rude of them. If I do say so myself. And where's all the kelp at? Let's check this island while we're out here. Yeah, so right there you'll see the fence line. It goes up. I'll show you on the map here. So our base. Oh, wrong way. Our base is right there. Oh, God. Our base is right here. The hunter base is like right around here, I think. And so we kind of only can go right all through here because here's the border. Um, unless we can take them out, which I don't really want to tango with them just yet. We only have, I think, five... Come on. We only have five uh, shotgun shells. We have a bunch of pistol ammo, but the pistol ammo is kind of garbage. Garbage. Okay, let's see. Protein is going down again. Thought we were done with this starving ourselves. I guess not. Seems like it's gonna be an all the time thing, at least for a while. I'm trying to see. Okay, let's make our way over here. We'll follow the shoreline over this way again. Hook back around. Now when we get over there, we have to be cautious, because that is going to be where the hunters are. And that's where they go to the water to fish and all of that. Hopefully they do not come out today. Hopefully they got all their fish they needed yesterday. Keep an eye on the shore. For rabbits as well. So I wouldn't mind nabbing one of them. Maybe. Hopefully we'll have something in our trap. I'm not going to hold my breath for it, but it would be nice. I kind of want to sneak up there and... Grab that stuff. There's a chicken right there. And we have stamina to chase him down, but he's going to run right into that wolf. I know it. Let's see if we can get this. Ooh, I'm backing off. I'd really like that chicken. Oh. He growled. That freaking chicken just hanging out next to the wolf. In what world does that make sense? And also, another thing. In what world does it make sense that... An arrow takes down a chicken, but a pistol round does not. That's some crazy stuff. When I first tried that, I was shocked that the chicken, I shot the chicken with a 9 mil, and it just took off running. Same with the rabbits. Shot the rabbit with the 9 mil, it just took off running. It takes two shots, in case you were curious, as long as you hit them. Ooh, was that two? No, that was just one. Thought it was two. Must have been a shadow. I think there's a pearl over there. Let's go over here, get this pearl. This is where we need to start paying attention, because right there on the shore is where they will come down to fish and gather water, whatever they do. Hunters, whatever hunters do, down at my lake. 
in my waters. Besides pissing me off. They are annoying. I can't believe. I wonder if it's something in the game algorithm that knew. Like it, it calculated and tracked my. Uh, where I went most frequently. And then set that base in my way. I would not doubt it. Oof, 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 oof. Hello. I did not even see you there. I was going to go up, take a peek. I still might. For rabbits, there's a bear over there. A wolf right there. If he stays there, I can skirt up the rock cliff right there. And check it out. So, I'm still trying to figure out what the reasoning is for not being able to get out of the water easily. There's a flipping deer over there too. No oh man, we're not gonna make it up that way. Where'd that bear go? Oh man, watch him be right at the top. There he is over there. Okay, we're good I think. As long as there's nothing else up here. looking for some rabbits or a chicken it's getting dark we need to start making our way back otherwise we're gonna be cold and stuck out in the dark which I do not want should we take down that deer I think, I think I could probably hit it. Not positive, but I could definitely give it the old college try. Yeah, I'd say let's try it. Uh, it's getting dark, maybe not. Cause I don't, I think it takes like three or four arrows. I don't know if I have the time to go chasing it. I really don't want to lose all my arrows. Where'd that wolf go? Oh, come on. Where did the deer go? That, that's a rabbit, I think. Yeah, that's a rabbit. Come on, hold still. Got him. You don't even need to hold still. I'm so hungry. My aim was dead on. Okay, we really need to start heading back. So we don't get stuck out here. Some rifle ammo, yeah. What I'm talking about. I don't want to run into a flipping bear or something either. Because when it gets dark, it gets dark. Okay, let's go. Let's go. We're just going. We got one rabbit. We can go back, check our traps. We're out of stamina. I'd like to make it back before it gets dark, but I don't know if that's going to happen because we don't have any stamina. And we don't have anything to eat. Man, stamina's a killer. Get out of the water. Oh god, I know you guys can't see right now, because uh, I can barely see. But I am trying, I'm getting cold now. <sighs> okay, here we go. We're going to try and go check our trap. Check both our traps, honestly. Here come 
use the rain. Ooh. And we got something. Nice. See, that's what I like. That is why we did it. Now I gotta remember where I put the fish trap. There it is. That's why we did it. Because we can go out looting all day. Come on. And come back. Yeah, baby. Take that. Oh, no. Put that back. Okay. And then come home and get us some protein right there. So that's an extra rabbit we wouldn't have had. Which is super helpful. Because we only got one. So let's go ahead and cook these up first and foremost. There we go. That's going to be so good in our belly. We can... I'm pretty sure... I'm just going to harvest this for oil. Because I know we need a lot of that fish oil to make our antidotes. And I th I'm thinking I definitely need to get at least one antidote in storage. So that way, if and when I get sick, I don't have to stress so much about it. So, let's get our food cooked up. Let's check on our power situation after this. I don't want to burn this. So once we get this, we'll check the power because I want to see where that's at. After one day of it rebuilding. So we are at 500 and 100. So, yeah, okay. I guess... It's not going to build any energy without us actually doing something for it. So yeah, we definitely need to get either a solar panel or a wind turbine. So now we need two rope. Oh, we need 200 mass. 100 power. Golly. We can't even do that. How are we going to build? So then I guess... We have the generator. That will generate us power. So we need something that's going to generate us mass. And there it is. A mass fabricator. Converts power into mass. So we need this next. Right? What is this? 120. Yeah. No matter what we do, we need... So yeah, we need the mass fabricator next. So let's go ahead and see... I think we have everything to make that. We might need some more planks, but we can make those. We need this, this, and this, I believe. And mass fabricator. Yep. Booyah, baby. Okay, so let's get that made. Alright. Let's take this. Now, let's... We should probably start carrying our shotgun ammo since we now have a shotgun we don't need the rifle ammo okay so now I guess how's this work so we put biofuel how much of that do we have we only have five how do we make biofuel can we make biofuel There it is. Biofuel. Oh, look at that. That's what these are used for. Oh, no. That's good. I like that. Is that right? Yeah, boy. Oh, we could craft a bunch of that. Let's see. I want to see how much it takes to... Oh man, we need biofuel and ash and antlers for that. Good night. I want to see how much biofuel it takes to fill the... Whatchamacallit. Generator. I don't think we're going to be able to fill it with what we have here. But, we will see. Let's see how much one gives us. And then... I uh, probably shouldn't run it right now because it's refilling on its own. But once it caps out, wait, 
I just made the mass fabricator. I actually needed to make the mass storage first. How much is that? Alright, so we can make that next. We just need to make some more planks. Which we can do. Put all our wood away. I forgot. Okay, so we got that. Let's put this stuff away. Uh, how do you make rope? Sinew and cordage. Man, three sinew. We only have eight. And I know... Where did it go? Right here. I know we're going to need that for... Let's see how much one fuel takes. I know we're going to need the sinew for um, clothing, I think. So we're going to throw one in there. Oh my goodness, that did us no good. Luckily we get a bunch of these plants. That's three, four. Okay, so I'd say it takes probably 15 to fill it up. Because that was 12, I believe, if I counted right. So let's throw this in there, that and that. I'm going to move this and this over with the other one. I should probably make some arrows, so we are getting low. Give me some wood. Make some sticks. And then we'll make some arrows. And then, I would like, while we're here, to go back up top and actually check how much sunlight we're getting early in the morning again. See if it's it was 40% earlier. So I want to check that again and see how much we're getting. And how many arrows do we get again? I'm hoping two. Because if not, that is... Not cool. As it takes two nails just to make the arrows. Shotgun slugs. Yeah, okay, so we get two per. So, boom. Let's go ahead and make the rest of that. Alright. Now, put this away. That, that, that. That. Um, I'm going to go ahead and craft a few more of these boards like I said next we will make the mass storage we definitely need that uh, I think we have everything we just gotta wait for this to fill back up and we'll do that let's check this light 40% again so yeah in the morning it's about 40% right there it might be because of all the cloud cover but that's still not too bad. Uh, it gets 100% in the daytime, so that's good. Now, oh, we do need to fill that back up before we forget. Okay. Now, bottle of water. Yeah, I guess we gotta go back out there. We gotta go back out there and get some more food again. Food's gonna. What is this? Sandstone ore. That needs to go in the other one. Yeah, we need more food again. We're hurting for protein, guys. We are hurting for protein. We're actually hurting for greens, too. But they're a little easier to get than the protein. That protein's killing us. Literally killing us. So let's put this up, and this up, and that. Alright, let's go. Let's go back at it. Let's check our traps. We'll let that storage and power, the mass and power build. Check our traps real quick. And nothing. I figure it's probably too early. There's some kelp right there. Let's get it. I mean, not going to pass it up when it's... 
so willingly showing itself for us. Okay. There we go. Where did we put that trap? Right there. Okay, nothing. Nothing in it. That's alright. That's alright. It was only overnight. Alright, so I think we're going to call it there. We're going to let all this stuff build up. And then when we come back next, I think we're going to make the mass storage. Uh, we got a good bit done this time. We got our power storage done. And then... Oh, wait. We made our mass fabricator. Let's go ahead and throw that out. Almost forgot about that. So, we'll just put that right here for now. Boom. So, we got both of those up now. We're good to go. And, yeah, we'll leave it at that. Next time, like I said, we'll do the mass storage. I hope you guys did enjoy this episode. If you guys did, make sure you like the video subscribe to my channel so you know when i'm posting new content and again drop any comments you have down below whether it's just tips you have for me playing the game because i am new to this or if you just want to say hey and i will catch you guys in the next episode peace